Alright, so this will be a video on how to set up and install the FutureBit Moonlander 2. All links will be in the description. First thing we need to do is download the mining software. I'm on Windows 64, so this is the version I'm going to download. Threat has been detected. Alright, that's just a false positive, so for now I'm going to disable the antivirus. And then retry. Alright, extract it. Okay, so the FutureBit Moonlander 2 can mine any script based coin, but for this video I'm going to be mining Litecoin and I'm going to be doing it at the Litecoin pool. And make an account. I've already created an account, so I'm not going to do that. Alright, so now we need to edit the software. And this is the file we're going to edit. Right click it and click edit. And this is the part we're going to change. If we didn't change this, you'd be mining to somebody else's account. So put your username there. Click save. Alright, you're good to go. So now plug in your Moonlander. And start mining. Give it a few seconds. Alright, she's up and mining. If you plugged it in and the device came up unknown or you had some other problems, you need to install the driver. That link is in the description and you can end this video now. If you have an antivirus, I'm going to show you how to deal with that next. Alright, so I've re-enabled the antivirus. Threat has been detected. It finds it and removes it. So what we need to do is this is the files path. So we're going to copy this. We're going to click settings. We're going to go down here to exclusions. And we're going to add it. Click OK. And now we need to restore the file. And you're good to go.